Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Audra with Anatomy of Worship, anointing for the nations. Hey, you guys, long time no see or talk to you guys. I hope you guys are having an amazing Friday. I definitely am. I'm, it's, it's one of my favorite days, so it's a good day. It's a good day, and I'm all smiles because I'm really excited about what God is doing. And I just want to share a little bit with you. I won't be before you very long at all. But, you know, I just want to come in here and encourage you. One thing, remain in God. Keep your eyes focused on what He is doing. Everything else around you, I promise, is either distraction or, well, it's a distraction. I was going to say for you to be aware of what goes on around you. But it's a distraction if it takes your mind off of God onto that thing. It's a lot of stuff that's going on. It's like, oh my God, it's heartbreak. You know, just things, it's life, right? Life happens. We don't deny any of that. But keep your eyes focused on what God is doing. Because that is so much greater. That is so much better. It's so much bigger. There is so much that God has for you. And you just don't want to miss it, Dylan, and looking at stuff that's not in line with what he's doing that's basically what i'm saying so i just want to encourage you guys focus on what god is doing focus on what he has right before you so let me just share this and i'm gonna get off of here but this morning i was practicing my piano and um i don't know how long i had my foot off the sustain pedal but you know the sustain pedal helps connect your notes it just helps it sound more together and sustained you know it, it it connects the melodies and everything it's not like a immediate lift it just kind of sustained and immediately i heard the lord say this is how my love is this is how my love my love is a sustained love and i'm like oh that is so good god i was like oh can i share it <laughs> He's like, yes tell my people that my love is a sustained love. So I hope that you guys are still continuing to pursue God. You know, if I got to do another 21 days of pursuing the presence of God, I most certainly will, whatever I got to do to get your eyes focused on Him, I'll do it. But in that, He wants us to continue to pursue His love. Love conquers all. His love is everything that we need. You know, I think of a past, a few past videos I was talking about fear and how to overcome fear. Well, it's perfected in love. The way to overcome that is to make sure that you are perfected in God's love. And so I'm going to be praying. and Well, I have been, but even more so now after God gave me that, that word, um, that we just experience his perfected love. I'm praying for a God encounter for you all, for me too, a love encounter. God's love continues. It goes on and on and from generation to generation. It never stops. We can keep seeking and asking because there's so much more of it that he wants to give us. His love, it conquers everything. It's everything that we need. That is the answer for everything that's going on in this world is God's love. You know, the remnant got it. And then the church will finally stand up and get that. But the remnant, we got it. We understand that and we're asking for more and for more. The love of Christ is how anatomy of worship is going to cultivate a global community of true worshipers. As I continue to talk about the love of God and he shows you his love and you experience his love and you want more and more and more, you're going to be running crazy trying to make sure that your life is aligned with God. Make sure that you're living a holy life, holy and pleasing to him what your life is going to look like because of the love of Christ I'm telling you guys it is so good and it's more and more intense so of course I have a scripture oh I don't even know if I have it ready but I think let me grab my bible here this is from uh, Psalms 136 I'm just going to read the last verse it's 26 verses I'm reading from the NIV 
Psalms 136, 26. I want you to read the whole thing, but I'm just going to read the last verse to sum it all up. And when you get done doing everything, this is what I want you to do. Give thanks to the God of heaven. His love endures forever. That's it. Forever. How long is forever? Forever. Forever, ever, ever, ever. It lasts forever. So give thanks to him. Continue to seek him. Give God no rest. He has so much more to give you because he's a big God. He wants to do big things. He wants to show you his big, abundant love. Right? Yeah. I'm excited. That should get y'all excited. So there you go. Happy Friday. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for listening, for sharing, for commenting and liking. Um, don't forget to hit the bell so you know the next time I come on and do a video. Um, if this is your first time, you're new, consider subscribing. God is doing some amazing things and he's moving. I'm on here once a week and I feel like I'll be doing more and more, but I have a lot of other things going on. This is another reason why I came on here and said to make sure that you're focusing on what God has you doing. Cause I'm getting ready to start another I'll tell you about it some other stuff is happening but it's because I'm focused on God I'm not focused on all the stuff that's happening around me I see it I'm not in denial I'm praying I'm praying for you all I'm praying for your families I'm probably praying for your destiny I'm praying for our country I'm praying for I'm praying okay in general however we have a job to do right that comes First, you know, that's priority and alignment with what God's will. So I can do my part, right? My part is important. Your part is important because we are going to be an example for somebody else. And it's not fair to hold up somebody else's blessing because we're not doing what we're supposed to be doing, right? So there's that. So consider subscribing if you haven't already. Um, please share this. This is good. Happy Friday. I love you guys with the love of the Lord. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.